Hey y'all, welcome back. If it ain't cheap, I'm not buying it. Today is Saturday, September the 21st, and I wanted to come on and, and let you see uh, another haul that I did uh, this morning at the thrift store, and I went to the Dollar Tree as well. So without further ado, let me show you what I got. So I went over to the thrift store this morning at 9 o'clock, and um, it was already packed. I said, oh my God, everybody knows now about the store. I'm just going to have to try to find me another, um, you know, place to go. But looking um, again, I went down the aisle and um, they had put some new stuff out for the 50% off for Christmas. So I found this pretty red um, dish or it could be a candle holder. And I paid, um, it was 49 cents, so I got it for 25 cents. And I think this would go really nice, uh, the compliment, um, the cranberry red, uh, votive one that I had got, um, the other day and with the wreath. So I'm going to show you how I, um, place this when I do my tablescape for Christmas. And then I just found this simple, uh, clear bowl. Um, for 79 cents you can never uh, have enough clear bowls this could be a little potato salad macaroni salad you know um, leftovers wrap it up or whatever so I, I needed it so I got it um, and then I came across these cute little Jim Bean um, wine or um, shot to me they're like shot but put a little shot or brandy sniffers in them and they were 19 cents again so i thought these were cute um to sit on your bar card or you know at your bar um if someone just wants to have a quick shot instead of your normal uh shot glasses so 19 cents not too bad and then um i thought this was so adorable look how cute that is see the detail of it and it was 69 cents and uh, with 50% off I actually paid like what 35 cents for it so I thought that was so cute and then I seen another one but by me unwrapping uh, my stuff to get prepared for today I noticed that it broke off and I'm like super upset but my handy dandy glue gun will glue it back together so I'm not too worried about it, but just to show you guys what it actually, you know, looked like. So I got two for 75 cents all together. Well, 35, I'm not going to be doing the math all the time. So um, they were 35 cents a piece, total 70 cents. But look how cute that is. You know, and um, these will be nice to sit on your table for your tablescape. And... Um, they also would be really nice um, to give as a, to a little girl for a gift with maybe some earrings or a little piece of jewelry or a bracelet inside as well. A little, you know, pop over uh, sneak gift. And you could probably maybe uh, where this receipt, where this tag is at, paint their name and maybe the year. So, got these two. I thought that was a um, really cute find. And then I saw these yesterday, but it was so many people in there and I was just over it because I was upset that I didn't get there on time, but they had t a ton of these yesterday. And what attracted me to this was not the wreath part, but the base. So instead of getting one, you know me, I got to get doubles. But I got two. And I didn't just get two. I got three. Look how cute these are. And these could be utilized um, for uh, Valentine's Day. But my main um, purpose of purchasing, purchasing these were going to be um, for Christmas. And as I study these and look at them, I was only thinking about ripping this part off and keeping the base. So we're going to have to stay tuned and see um, what I actually end up doing uh, with these. 
um, further down the line as Christmas gets here. Um, I may rip this off and save the berries and, um, you know, re repurpose the berries and uh, do something else. But when I got up to the register, I said, oh, no, there's no, there's no price on here. So um, the girl had made a mistake when she was ringing up um, some of my 50% off, so she had to go get the manager anyway. So what she ended up doing is giving these to me for 25 cents a piece. And that... I mean, I was just so thankful because this pot alone, you know, to paint it, it's a lot of work. So for 25 cents, I said, hey, I'll take it. Thank you so much. So the next item that I found, I could not believe. Brand new in the pack. Never open from Walmart. Red tablecloth. Super score red tablecloth. And I got the 60 by 102. Anyway, these were $2.99. So I didn't just get it in red. I also got it in gold, which is my favorite color. Okay. And this one was $3.99. So these were also 50% uh, off today because they fell under the um, Christmas uh, decoration. So I'm going to have some lovely tablescapes um, with these in the next um, few months coming up. Because I love my gold. And then I have my anniversary, uh, New Year's Eve. Um, and I, I usually... I usually do a black and um, white and a silver um, thing for my anniversary but who knows um, I may just do all gold this year but um, super super great fine so this was $3.99 I paid two dollars and it's regularly ten dollars at the store and then this one was three dollars so I paid a um, dollar fifty I'm not sure why the difference um, they're the same table um, just it's the same size and everything so okay so this one was $7.87 and this was $9.97 so maybe whoever was marking it thought you could get another dollar for this but not a bad deal on these so I was like super happy so that um, everything that I purchased this morning from uh, the thrift hall came up to eight dollars and some change I don't actually have the um, receipt right in front of me but I did a ten dollar under a ten dollar deal so ladies get to your thrift stores you know start early because a lot of people are out um, getting this stuff and they're getting um, you know their decor ready for the holidays especially if you're into entertaining and decorating your house the thrift way is the way to go you do not have to run to Ross TJ Maxx Z gallery home goods Pier one you know all those name brand stores uh, and spend a ton of money you just have to take your time maybe every Saturday to go to the thrift store and plan a budget and go in get one piece by piece until you actually have your whole tablescape and that's what I've been doing for the past I guess about four weeks now and um, I'm at the point that I'm I'm done running you know to the thrift store I've got my Christmas stuff plus my Christmas stuff from last year um, and my main concern this year because I just got my dining room table and redid it that I wanted to have a lovely Thanksgiving table so that's why I started doing my thrifting again sometimes you can be a hoarder and just have too much stuff that you're just you see at the thrift store, you want to get it, you bring it home, you have no room, and it's just sitting in boxes. So this may be my last um, video for a while doing thrifts because just within that last four weeks, I have accumulated a lot of glassware and dishes and things that I do not have space for right now. And my husband said, don't bring anything else in the house. We We have no room until we move so with that being said we're gonna move on real quick um, to the Dollar Tree haul that I went and did earlier 
well after I left um, the thrift store so I have a Dollar Tree that's like right down the street from me across from Walmart but everybody here on base goes to that Dollar Tree so I try to sneak out and go to the Dollar Tree that's down by the beach and look what I found beautiful look how pretty these napkins are See that pretty um, gold tone yellowish? And this is going to go nicely on my table. So I picked this up. And then I could not find uh, my bling wrap. That's the adhesive one, which is my favorite um, arts and crafts project now to work with because I don't have to worry about glue and burning my fingers. But that Dollar Tree was just out but bingo I scored five bling wraps so Sunday is usually my super Sunday craft day so you guys will be seeing an upcoming project with all my bling and I got it in gold so I'm gonna be working on some projects um, and hopefully I'll be able to get them done tomorrow and get them uploaded and you'll be able to see what I um, actually did with the bling wrap and then, because we had the hurricane here, um, I guess about two weeks ago, they cleaned off all of the candles. There was no taper candles in any of the dollar stores that I went to down here. So I just got this, instead of the, the bright white, I got it in like the neutral um, vanilla off beige, I guess, color. So these will go with the uh, little candlestick holders that I purchased in one of my thrift hauls so this was a good find and then this is also good um, also we use lose electricity during one of our storms so it's always good to have um, any type of candles in your house and then lastly I had showed you in a previous video um, when I did uh, my Dollar Tree walk through on Friday um, I got these Look at them. Look how pretty. Do you see that burnt rust orange color? Look how nice these are. So I'm going to show you how to actually make your napkin ring holder with these in an upcoming video. So please make sure that you like, you comment, and you subscribe, and you hit the bell for the notifications. So that way you'll know that I've uploaded a new video. And I want to thank you guys um, who have subscribed over the week. Um, I am at 28 subscribers now. I'm super happy because when I started this about a week ago, I only had six. So I know 28 is not a lot, but... Thank you guys um, who came over and subscribed. I really, really appreciate it. And like I said, I'm just trying to build up my channel, you know, to give me something to do um, on the weekend and um, just to reach out to other ladies and, and help them if they're on a tight budget and, and don't know how to maybe mix and match some of their items um and start getting back to um refurbishing things that you have in your home other than that you guys i would like to say um you know have a nice saturday and um i will get back with you guys later take care bye bye if it ain't cheap we ain't buying it like and subscribe Comment down below. Don't forget to ring that bell. And we'll see you on our next video. Bye.